Here is your one minute early literacy tip from the Davenport Public Library. In thinking about language and development, we often forget about the importance of nonverbal communication. Nonverbal cues are so important in developing and improving your relationships, especially with your children. Positive cues like smiling and hugging and stopping what you're doing to listen to your child lets them know that you really enjoy them and that you want to be around them. Negative cues like a grumpy tone of voice or a frown can send the opposite message. And this is interesting. If your nonverbal cues don't match what your words are saying, for instance, if you ask them a question but then don't hold any eye contact when they're answering, they will believe the nonverbal cues over your words. Remember that kids are learning about the world with every interaction. You can use your nonverbal cues to teach your child how, how to get along with others. For example, all those positive cues that you are sharing show them how to express positive emotions. Stopping and really listening and paying attention teach them to do the same. And that listening and paying attention, some of the best skills to have for success in school and later in life.